guys? How are you guys doing? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your boy Jay as always. So today in this video, it's gonna be different. It's story time. I'm gonna tell you guys how I got my 350Z. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for future uploads. And stay tuned for the installation video on the steering wheel. I'm just waiting on uh, my last part. So I should be receiving it sometime two weeks and a half or three. I'm excited, I can't wait. But anyways, the video starts now. Let's go back to a year and a half ago when I first got my Z. Hold on, fucking angle. Okay. So let's go back to a year and a half ago when I got my Z. Um, I was with one of my friends. His name's Chris. We were actually, uh, he used to own a Celica GT. Um, pretty sick. It was white, stick, you know. It was pretty bad. There was one time we went to a... Um, uh, I think he took his uh, brother and sister uh, swimming and um, we were waiting outside in the parking lot uh, back when you know vape was a shit we were vaping at uh, we kind of like hot box his car um, we were just talking like man you know what we should get a car you know, the same car friendship goes type of thing you know I me mean? uh, you yeah, know let's uh, keep in mind I do the, I do the, uh, the, the but I do know this guy for almost five, six years already. Um, we did come out in a quinceanera together. Um, but anyways, back to the conversation. We were talking about it. We we planned to get a Acura RSX Type S, um, but then we were like, nah, nah, you know what? Something with, you know, back wheel drive. What can we get? So we were thinking, we were just vaping and vaping when the idea came to me. Oh, let's get a Z. Fuck it. We agreed to it. Not even a month later. Honestly, I was looking at it. I was looking for it like crazy. Uh, me and my dad, my dad did help me out a lot to look for it too. So, you know, we were going to different. I wasn't planning to, you know, get it from a person, buying it off the owner. I actually was trying to get it off the dealer, you know? Um, so we we're going to different dealers and stuff. And uh, there's this one time I was taking them to work. I take that back. I was picking them up from work. You know, we came down uh, some street where there's a lot of dealers and uh, we stopped by, you know, we seen a, you know this dealer that had like five Zs, you know, had a blue one, had a black one, had this silver one, a yellow one, and a white one. So I'm over here like, oh, you know what, Dad? Let's stop by. It won't hurt. But um, you know what? We we stopped by and whatnot. And um, you know, we're looking at disease and stuff. I looked at this one. I fell in love with the color. It is silver. Um, it was worth not that much. You know for the miles that had it was pretty cheap in my opinion I did get it with 54,000 um, miles on it and um, I had no problem with it whatsoever me as a kid ever since I seen Tokyo Drift I fell in love with disease I know I've said this in my previous videos so I don't know but um anyways so we're looking at it like damn you know I want, I want this Z, like I really want it, you know? So we left, me and my dad were talking about it and uh, keep in mind, um, my pops did give it to me as a graduation gift uh, and uh, 18th birthday gift. Um, well, he didn't give it to me. All he did was, uh, you know what? He, he's like, hey, you know what? As, as a gift, I'll pay, you know, the down payment and you take care of the payments. So, you know what? fuck it pops let's do this i couldn't wait i was telling my dad like hey man come on do me the favor you know um what if somebody already got it like man he's like come down you know it's not the only z out there but still you feel me like it had the miles it had on it i mean it really doesn't matter how many miles it had but still you know i really wanted this car uh it was bone stock 
the only thing that it had I mean was the Intec and the rims it has some conic rims and uh, let me take that back wheels and uh, some it did have an exhaust system it was called I had the magnum flow exhaust so either way I wanted this color I wanted the Z so you know what I guess my dad got annoyed as hell um, we took the down payment I was happy as hell as soon as I got it off the lot I was fucking excited. You know what? We want to go pick it up. It was on a Saturday. I remember, man. I remember. I even asked for the day off. Um, I want to go pick it up. And uh, it was all this paperwork, whatever. Did all that. And um, as soon as I got in the Z, man, I felt dangerous, you know? Keep in mind, this is when I was barely getting into cars. I felt dangerous. I was like, man, where's the Lambos at? You know? Like, what's up? Like, where you guys at? You know? I'm trying to race. But, um... I fell in love, honestly. So I told my dad, you know what, take it for a test drive. You know, take it for a test drive. At that moment, I literally, I don't know, but I was shaky. My hands, I was like, every time I drive it, I'll be shaky as hell. Like, fuck is going on, Jose? But, anyways, I got my car. I showed it to my homeboys. I was like, hey, dude, like, guess what? What happened? I got the Z. You bullshitting. I'm serious, dude. Come to my house. I go to his house. He comes out, like, oh shit, let me drive it. So he, he, I let him drive it, I let him drive it, you know, a little test drive, and, um, man, wasn't this guy sweating as well? He was nervous, shaking, man, his hands were fucking wet, stupid, you know, all this sweat, um, so he tries to, like, you know, do a little drift, and, dude, I was scared as shit, I'm like, nah, like, hold on, hold on, you feel me, like, calm the fuck down, we're not on that level yet, it's too much power for us, so, relax, but, uh, a week and a half later, he gets hissy, and there you go. Um, we both were rolling on disease. We were both excited. You know, we were everywhere, honestly. Uh, we met a couple friends, you know, because um, of disease. So, all this happened, you know, all this happened a year and a half ago. And, um, yes, I haven't really done anything much to my car. I was slacking off. I had so many problems, to be honest, you know. But now that I'm on track, I'm not. Stop. I'm not. I'm just not. You know, I do have big plans for my Z. I fucking love my car. Honest to God. Like, I love my car, you know? And um, I will get my car where I want it to be. I'm not even close, you know? But it's okay. It all takes time. It all takes patience. I'm not rushing it because I know I could do it. Um, but this is the story on how I got the Z. Uh, first thing I went to do was the headlights. Headlights, you know. The headlights were stupid ugly. Um, so I ordered some um, Halo projecting lights. Fell in love with them. You know, I did take it to get installed when I could have done it myself. I was out of it at that moment, but it all happens. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I, we will have videos like this just so you guys could know I just feel like you know I have to connect with you guys like you guys do have to know you know like say about my past how, how I started with this um, so stay tuned for this guys if you guys like you know would like to see more videos like this make sure to give it a thumbs up and uh, if you guys want drop a comment you know it doesn't matter negative positive it, it's all good you know we do all learn from our mistakes Tell me if I'm doing something wrong. I would actually, I would also want to know you guys' opinion. So, just let me know, and um, I will see you guys until next time. And remember, stay positive, stay focused, keep your head up, do you, be you. See you guys until next time. Peace.